Hello everyone, Bon Harvester here. In this video, we will take a look 7 f3 and 8 bishop c4 move uh, in dragon accelerate dragon and hyper accelerate dragon positions. Um, 8 bishop c4 is a very tactical and sharp variation for both sides. Uh, this is not main variation as like 7 bishop f4, uh, bishop c4, or Mm, it's not lit the position something light like Yugoslav attack this is as and another position different position from other uh, variations and sideways but uh, I can say this one 8 bishop c4 is extremely sharp variation and I prepared my home preparations uh, to show you here uh, let's start to inspect variations and after that you will see what I try to mean. Uh, let me try. Let's start starting position. E4, C5, Knight, F3, a classical uh, dragon and accelerate dragon move order. And 8, Bishop, C4. Now, uh, if you remember... Uh, Seven uh, bishop c. If white plays seven bishop c4, black uh, will play queen a5. But uh, if white uh, play seven f3 and protect center after plays bishop c4, then black can play queen d6 right now. Queen d6 because e3 bishop is hanging, d2 pawn is hanging, and maybe in future moves. In black queen can attack bishop knight and center uh, from the f4 square. Here is uh, very good. Let's take a look variations. As you can see, this is very detailed uh, repertoire. Uh, let's go from main variation. Queen d2. Knight take on h4, and we are attacking queen, knight c6, um, knight d2, queen e7, knight e4, knight e7, and intermediate attack queen, king h8, bishop takes b6, bishop c4, bishop f3, and knight takes b5. Let's uh, Calculate three minor pieces, three minor pieces, two rook, two rook, five. Black has one extra pawn, and black has no big problems, no any problems here. Game is completely winning right now for uh, black. And let's take a look. F takes e4. After that, bishop e3, and as you can see, white has isolated pawn and black has pawn up. Black has uh, no problem here too. As you can see, uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. There's 8 side variations, and if I'm not wrong, there is just 2 playable variations for white, and other for all of other variations are losing variations. Uh, black has dominating advantage in games. Uh, one of Castle King sides. And other one is. Bishop b3, yes, I remember. Uh, other one is Bishop b3 uh, here. And we will. Uh, inspect uh, all variations. Let's start from uh, we inspected queen d2. Let's start again knight f5. Let's take a look knight f5. If uh, white try to take uh, g7 bishop with uh, this move knight f5 move, it's completely big mistake. Compl completely blunder. Knight f5, queen takes b2. And we want to take f3 knight, also we want to take 
f5 knight right now. Uh, if black white take black's bishop on g7, before we take uh, c3 and after bishop, and after that we can take this one because as you can see a knight is stuck. Knight cannot go anywhere. And this is losing position for white. Uh, a funny fact, uh, with this move I lost so much games in bullets, uh, bullet games. Uh, especially against strong players. Uh, one minute games or maybe hyperbolic games uh, it's very easy to win in games because people uh, trying this one quickly they think uh, bishop is protecting and we will take black's g7 bishop and after that we will win game but it's not haha <laughs> bishop b3 last second Yes, uh, one of playable variation for white, this move, bishop b3. Bish after bishop b3, knight take on e4, uh, knight d5, queen a5, c3, knight c5, knight c6, d6, knight e7, and king h8, knight c6, and rook c6, castle king side, rook c d8, Queen C8, Queen C2, Rook F8, Bishop F2, and King G7 moves. It's playable. Black's position is dominating. Uh, it's very good. Black has no problem. But uh, I want to say something. Uh, this is one of variation, and it's a little bit uh, complicated. I don't play this variation. I never play it in my life. And I take on E4. Uh, I don't like this variation because it's complicated uh, and after this position, uh, black's position, yes, better, okay, I understand, but there is no winning position, winning uh, chance. Uh, easily, black, white will uh, counter tiles and exchange rooks and after that join game again. It's just better for black. I played knight g4 here. I always played knight g4 here. F takes g4, knight g4, uh, we are attacking bishop and opening this bishop's way for uh, taking this knight. F takes g4, bishop takes d4, bishop takes d4, queen takes d4, queen takes d4, knight takes d4, castle king side, knight c3, knight d5, d6, h3, rook b8. Now, uh, this variation is more better than other variation. Let's take a look. Similar palm structure. Yes, symmetrical palm structure. Symmetrical palm structure. Two minor pieces. Whenever black wants, uh, black can exchange this bishop with knight, and it's meaning mm, symmetrical minor pieces, and also heavy pieces are symmetrical too. Palm structure is symmetrical. There is no any weakness or uh, beneficial things for black but let's take a look at this position 7 7 pound 7 pound this two, 2 pounds is uh, doublet this pound is isolated and also as you can see uh, after knight g4 there is a forcing variation. Uh, F takes, bishop takes, bishop takes, queen takes, queen takes, knight takes. This is forcing variation. B uh, white cannot, white cannot try here. For example, knight d5 or any complications. It's very easy to play. And trust me, uh, this variation uh, makes you very happy if you play this variation. Uh, just you have to be very careful about this uh, diag uh, this file and this diagonal because white's always trying to put pressure on uh, f7 pawn and also uh, don't mm, try to play e6 uh, just try to hold e7 pawn on e7 if you play e6 after that your black squares will be 
very weak and uh, it will be problematic situation for black that's because we are playing knight c6 going back for uh, protecting uh, e7 pawn against knight d5 that's why we are uh, taking bishop with bishop this knight also as you can see we can take with knights uh, and after bishop queen queen this one and how to defend e8 right now if rook goes uh, it's big problem because after that uh, rook f2 rook f1 bishop b3 everyone a nearly all of piece will be attacked f7 and this rook must be go uh, f8 and knight will be take this pawn it's no it's not uh, possible mm, this is the main uh, problem problem here that's why we are playing uh, this variation so uh, this is one of the um, strongest variation for white and we will uh, see second uh, variation in oh, uh, in future uh, in uh, our next variations let's take a look and on and on other variations right now queen d2 is we inspected this one knight f5 bishop b3 yes bishop b3 ah just one more thing about bishop b3 knight you thought yes uh, white can uh, of course try to castle king side here uh, there is no big difference between castle king side and castle king side nearly same game plan uh, same position and uh, same mid mid game mi middle game uh, ideas. Uh, that's because I didn't add a variation here. But you can if you want uh, to learn uh, castle king side, uh, you can check some games from databases. There is so much games about castle king side. I'm sure about it. I remember and. Um, if you need a strong preparation about castle king side or castle queen side, uh, just leave a message. Uh, I can prepare a nice preparation about just uh, for uh, this variation, knight g4 variation, knight, knight g4 variation. And after that, we will. Uh, I can add a uh, new video for about this variation. Okay, uh, keep going. Nine queen d2, knight f5, bishop b3. Now we can take a look. Knight c2, knight c2, horrible <laughs> because simply queen b4 is winning. And a3, a3. Uh, here is uh, start complications, some complications, but nearly all of moves better for black. Yes, let's take a look. And after a3, uh, I remember here there is a trap. I just want to show you. Don't take b2 pawn here. Never. If you take b2, knight e4, knight a4, and your your queen will be drop. This is a, a trap variation. Uh, be careful about this one. As you can see, there is no uh, chance to uh, survive your queen. Okay, let's start. Knight g4, my main move as always. F takes, and I'm trying to build same position uh, now i don't take with queen because if i take with queen after queen uh, when i take with knight as you can see black will be pawn down uh, that's because i taken with knight before and this c4 bishop is hanging queen d3 knight c6 knights can protect e5, e7 pawn my main idea 
it's always working and queen takes b2 losing e6 e6 is playable but i never uh, choose this variation uh, i'm not very strong players uh, such international master or grandmaster but i'm a uh, i have to say um, I beat some international masters, uh, FIDE masters, yes, but I'm not titled, uh, and I don't live with chess in my life, for example, 10 or chess in my, heart, in my, in, in my life, uh, but I always trying to play uh, strong chess games, that's because I trying to learn, I trying to improve, I trying to do everything about what I can uh, for to improve my chess, and that's because e6 is uh, brings some complications here again why i have to play e6 here and after e6 as you can see dark squares will be weakened again why i have to play this one i can play basically knight g4 here and i'm very happy about this one look there is no any big problem uh, isolated pawn double pawn everything is here But uh, there is a variation, uh, it's playable, a e6, 9e6, that's because I added it here, but maybe you can, uh, you can play this variation, you like these variations, that's because, let's take a look, queen d2, knight takes on e4, f takes on e4, bishop, bishop, queen, queen, and castle queen side, and after knight c2, knight c6, uh, this variation is very good for white, but sorry, black. And basically, castle king side. And after that, e4 is drop again. Knight e4, queen a5. And we took our piece back. b4, knight d4, bishop d4, bishop d4, queen d4. Uh, black is pawn up. But this is not very easy to play right now. Uh, sorry. Black can, white can play uh, a position like this. As you can see, uh, very problematic for black because black just have white white bishop and look this bishop's situation. <laughs> Uh, it's not easy, I'm sure about it. Uh, let's take a look. It's a little bit better for black, but in practical, if we think about practical uh, play, white is better here. White can. Uh, play better game here okay that's why I don't play e6 and knight e4 queen a5 uh, queen a5 why we didn't take this knight I'm just trying to remember I don't remember because I don't play this variation. Uh, let's take a look. If we take knight, ah, come on, it's easy. Yes, uh, queen is dropping here. Queen e5, c3, knight e7, castle king side, and d5. This is one variation too. About nine e6. Uh, this is playable for black, no, no problem for this variation, but this one is a problematic line. Okay, let's keep continuing. We inspected a uh, last of a3 and now queen d3. It's easy in knight e5, forking queen and bishop. And after that, queen b2 and so much hanging pieces uh, it's very easy to play uh, king d2 is forcing here because 
uh, at the same time rook is hanging king d2 i i like this variation uh, and i won some ga some games with this variation queen b4 and we are attacking bishop b2 bishop b3 and knight c6 everything is okay right now queen is safe uh, these pawns are isolated uh, everything is similar except pawn structure and uh, pawn count black is better here and now castle king side after castle king side knight g, knight g4 again basic f takes g4 knight d5 and knight c6 this is a similar variation look oops sorry here and here there is a single uh, difference uh, in another variation castle queen side in this variation castle king side and after we play uh, for example uh, knight c6 or let's think on it bishop b3 okay uh, maybe d3 and it's completely similar position yes mm, that's the uh, short side casting variation and now castle king sides there is a uh, queen b2 variation is possible too knight e4 queen b4 uh, two pieces are hanging right now uh, bishop b3 knight take on d4 bishop d4 d6 rook b1 queen e1 queen a5 rook e1 and rook d8 it's possible black is better here uh, but if you don't want uh, remind everything you can just play uh, knight g4 as you can see knight d e2 <coughs> queen queen b4 bishop b3 e6 and again e6 i don't like e6 such positions look black bishop white uh, black's white bishop here b6 bishop e6 this is very good move because uh, this diagonal is closed rook fd1 rook e7 sorry queen e7 and this is not easy to play for black i can say this one because white has strong battery on d file and white cannot black cannot play d5 easily as you can see five piece is defending this sorry five piece is are defending here uh, if B, if black play d d6 uh, it's hanging it's instantly lost uh, that's because we don't need uh, to defend somewhere. We can just play some variation else. Uh, we inspected this one. And last variation, knight cbb5, queen d4, uh, bishop is hanging. Bishop e2, knight take uh, d4, bishop take d4, d6, rook b1, and queen a5. Again, nearly same variation, but as I said before, uh, these variations are needs more uh, remindings, complications, and you can play simply knight g4 here. It's very good end game. Uh, you have very good end game chances because of isolated and double pawns. Uh, but there is a single problem. You have very careful. Uh, you have very careful about f7 pawn. Okay. Now let's take a look last variation knight c b b5 this is last variation a6 attacking knight f5 this is very complicated uh, but i won uh, more than 10 games with this uh, variation and it was not in uh, bullet games it was uh, rapid and blitz, ga blitz games very, I think very important variation this one. Knight f1, knight f5, queen a5 check, bishop d2, and now queen d8. Uh, we forced to 
Kle e, Bishop go D2, e, D2. Knight H6. Uh, it's impossible as you can see because we can take uh, this one uh, if bishop try to protect this one we can take it this one too and after that uh, this knight's no way to run away it's trapped uh, it's easy knight h6 bishop h6 bishop h6 a takes b5 Bishop f6, Bishop takes c4, Bishop a6, and Queen b6. Now, uh, Castle Kingside is prevented. Uh, bishop, queen e3 is threatening if Bishop go somewhere else, and also d2 is hanging. Queen c1, and after that d5, and broken, uh, breaking up center or attacking. Uh, King on center, white king on center, because it's not easy to uh, castle king side here. And also, uh, white has min minor pieces against rook. Uh, it uh, makes better attacking chances for black uh, because minor pieces better pieces at at opening and uh, middle game side. Rooks are better at end game, in my opinion. That's because this variation is uh, dominating for black. Yes, we inspected all of variations. Uh, knight, queen d2, knight f5, <coughs> bishop b3, knight c e2, a3, queen d3, castle king side, and knight c b5. I hope you like these variations uh, and I hope uh, you win very strong uh, games against strong opponents and thank you for watching see you in our next video uh, goodbye